woke up at four in the morning and my first thought was how much I hate my titties. And that's kind of set the tone for my day. And all day I've just been crying about how much I hate my body. And you don't have to worry about me, I'm still fine. Like I still like woke up and did my meditation and did my workout, but through the whole thing, all of that, I was crying about how much I hate my body. And it would just be so much easier if I could tell myself it doesn't matter, but my job is like tied to it. I just, I've been losing a lot of weight. Like I've lost 15 pounds in one month and I feel like I've gone from a C cup to a B cup. And I just feel like my titties were already saggy before. And now they're just like, the skin is so loose and they're sagging so much because I used to have double D's and people online, they always make fun of me for the way my nipples are low and the way that my titties sag. Not just people online, even fucking Ethan would make fun of my boobs and I think that's part of the reason I'm so upset. That's still affecting me. And the thing is, I try to be logical and I try to rationalize it and be like, well, my nipples are low and they point down because it's for a baby and I'm going to feed a baby down here. So my nipples and my boobs are going to be perfect for feeding a baby. But the thing is, they're not perfect for my job. And the thing is, it just really hurts me the way people talk about them because I know that they are the way they are. But and I know it's my fault, like it's my fault for constantly losing weight that I shouldn't be losing, but like I had double fucking D's when I was 14 years old and they were nice and they were perky and they were normal and I ruined them by starving myself, but I can't stop starving myself and don't do it on purpose. I don't starve myself to be skinny, not all the time at least, not really since high school. I just have a really hard time feeding myself. And I have a really hard time finding foods that are safe for me to eat. And my I have a really hard time knowing when I'm having a hunger cue. I feel like my body doesn't give me good hunger cues. I just feel like I'm never going to be with somebody that loves my body because anybody would rather be with somebody with a normal body whose tits haven't been ravaged from fucking anorexia and who I feel like they're also fucked up from whatever's going on with my hormone issues and <laughs> they're just fucked up and I hate them and I want to cut them off and I've always wanted to cut them off since I first started getting them and in third grade when I first got the knot I cried and I cried and it made me sick and I threw up and it was so painful and I hated it and I just didn't want boobs and I kept saying that to everyone and everyone thought I was crazy or funny and then Whenever a dress or something or a shirt would make it look like I had boobs, I would have a freak out attack and like rip it off of me and cry to my mom and be like, I don't want boobs, I don't want boobs. And like, obviously in hindsight, that was gender dysphoria for sure. But also I feel like <laughs> I just knew how much pain these motherfuckers were gonna cause me, physical, emotional, and spiritual, and I don't want them. Like. <laughs> It'd be one thing like if I was just losing weight and so my titties were getting smaller, I would be fine having cute, a cute little handful of tits, but they're small now and they're just hanging down like a fat person who loses a bunch of weight and now their skin is just hanging. That's my tits. My tits are just hanging like fat person skin. Ugh. And the worst part is I know from experience that if I put back on the weight, they're going to be just as saggy as they are now, but bigger, but never get perkier again. And through the rest of my age, through the rest of my life, my tits will only get lower unless I pay to get them lifted. But I'm probably never going to do that because why the fuck would I pay $5,000 for something that should not matter? Like the obvious cure is to just stop feeling this way need to just stop feeling this way and stop caring and realize that my boobs are for babies and not for men but it's so hard when my job is directed towards men and i have no ass to fall back on also i have hated my boobs back even when they were perky like it's not like when i was 14 i was like yeah i love my boobs because when i was 14 I realized that I had inverted nipples and they were never going to just pop out. And so I got, I talked to my mom about it and she's like, oh, I had them too. And then I had to get these suction cup things that sucked, that like you stick them in your bra and then they hold on and they suck your nipples out slowly, like with, with suction. 
not with like electrical suction like but like just like physical like anyway slowly I got those and I kind of half pried my nipples out I gave up on them after like a few months and so now my nipples all are weird because I only half got them out with the suction cups too and I hated them even back then so like I feel like I'm just doomed to hate my boobs no matter what and it's like whether they're big or whether they're small like it's always gonna be like I can't change my nipple placement unless I get surgery either and like my nipple placement's always just gonna be low because I have naturally low nipple placement which the nipple's not supposed to be in the middle of the boob anyways because you don't feed the baby from there so I need to just think logically about it but it's so hard so hard not to tie my worth and my value to the way my titties look when the amount of money I make is probably tied to the way that my titties look and I just I don't know what to do hey it's me Lex with the Lex that's editing this video not that Lex I was crying over my titties I just wanted to come in and say Please do not compliment me or tell me, oh, your tits are beautiful. Oh, they're amazing. Oh, don't worry about it. This is not, I'm not posting this to fish. I made the video to rant and get out of my system. And the only reason it's going up is just in case somebody can relate to it and it helps them feel better in some way being related to or maybe the advice about the babies will help some people who are self-conscious about their tits. Maybe that mindset will help someone. And that's the only reason I'm putting this up. Please do not compliment me. I take compliments the same way I take insults, which is as nothing. So, I mean, you can do it. It's not going to affect me, but I'm just letting you know. I'm not going to reply to anyone talking about my titties. Thank you.